All right, then. Interesting. Well, then. Greetings. The truth is... Well then. Appreciate it. Hang on. <laughs> Be that as it may. Truth is... What? Remember those winning strategies I mentioned? Well, the first lesson starts now. I imagine you've led a rather rough life, considering the tribe you hail from. The world is full of unsavory sorts. That's why if you want to improve your life, you must never show a scoundrel mercy. If you're made a fool, you must pay it back in spades. Kindness is weakness, and the weak get robbed blind. Thanks. Regard this not as the art of deception, but rather how to steal hearts. The morally sound way, of course. A wise choice. The devious schemer, Alonzo. Within him dwells the virtue of the faker. Nurture thy bond with him, and a new power yet slumbering within thee may awaken. I assumed you were but a momentary distraction, but there is more to you than that. Who wears the crown next matters little to me. But if it's you, I wager it'll be quite a ride. I'll be heading to Brylehaven after this. Let's meet again there. Hmm. All right, then. Let's go. All right, then. All right, then. Where to?
Mm. But... <laughs> what? But... It's over. Hmm? In those days. It's a living hell. Really? Just a fantasy. No. Why? Listen. Don't ever forget that. Therefore, <sighs> no pain can stop me now. Even then. You there. I'm off. Time marches on, and the age of a new king draws nearer. Is it finally time? So? All right, people then. missing. Let's go. All right, then. Hey. Now then. been waiting. Let's go sniff out that bounty, shall we? Let's move. This place here. You would pursue peril. Ha-ha! <laughs> Tally-ho, then! Trusting the advice of Morris, Barden's right-hand man, the party takes the gauntlet runner towards the giant sandworm's nest. They could not know what they will encounter here, nor that it might be only the beginning of their trials. What to pick? My... So... Whew. Hmm... Uh... Well... Huh. 
All right. Oh, that's right. Ooh. All right. Come look at this! The Gauntlet Runner comes to a stop at the midnight sunsets. The grandeur of it stirs something in each of them. Could a creature this large have truly existed? Or is it an oddity shaped by the sands? Another truth lost to time. Indeed. Look. What happened? What? No. Right then. Still, though. Yeah. All right. Hail. Let's go. running for the throne, of course. Isn't that why you're out here? I'm sorry, but the throne will be mine. I can't afford to lose. Not when true change is at stake. Here and now, nobody gets off easy. Not even you. Now let's do this, fair and square. Have it! Uh, I don't think she's thought this through. But I guess we'd better put our dupes up. I know we've got some history. Swordmaster! We can't afford to let her beat us. <laughs> <laughs> Is that all? I can't lose. The parapets are counting on me. Uh, uh, is that all? Swordmaster! I can slash! Tougher than I thought! <laughs> to hand fight I can't win I can't take this this frustration satisfactory
out in it. Mm. If you want my opinion. What we have here is... <laughs> oh, certainly. I see. In it. The truth is... I hope. And then... The gauntlet runner takes repose at an encampment as the sun sets along the sandy horizon, darkness settling in. What creeps through the sands outside in the night is unknown to the party as they take their well-deserved rest. Real chilly. Hmm. Although... Of course! Time marches on, and the age of a new king draws nearer.
The gauntlet runner quietly comes to a stop before the giant sandworm's nest. It is the day that the sleep-inducing sand flash dances in the sky. Their target is Heisme Noctua, a villain still unseen, who has caused the woes of Martyra. Will they successfully claim his bounty to great fortune? This weather should have all the sandworms conked out. Speaking of which, what exactly do they look like? I only got a glimpse of the lava, and cooked at that. As tube-like as any worm, they grow quite steadily in their lifetime. It's the tremendously large ones that end up deadly threats. Ugh, I don't even want to think about it. What kind of man would want to live in a den of those things? Did you hear that? Just now. Beasts, and not just one. Should they not be asleep? Hey, what's... Whoa, whoa, whoa! What the...? So that's it, eh? But what's going on? Did we get bad information? That's no sandworm. A horror like that could only be... A human? We're not getting away without a fight! Damn it! We can't die here! This isn't what we heard about! What's going on? Ugh, looks like we can't brute force through this one. Swordmaster! The power of life! Let come forth, royal soul! Witch! Is everyone alright? Oh, power of heroes! Swordmaster! I won't hold back! With blade in hand! A worthy foe after all! It went underground! I think we managed to drive it back! Truth be told.
I say take it with you. But... So apparently... No problem! But... Look! Hurry! <clears throat> No holding back! Control, you gotta aim better than that! So Control, badly God. wounded! Can anyone heal him? Uh. Stroll can't take any more! By the power! Someone we can do him. this! I'm obliged! My thanks! Let Stroll justice broken. prevail! This attack will do much better! Swordmaster! Just 
faded. I'm all prepared. His attacks will do much less damage. Hey, don't get sloppy, Captain. Oh, you don't. wounded. Can anyone heal him? This is nothing. Stroll can't take Magic any more. Knight. Still standing, I see. Sword master! No, you first. Huh? We're not out of this yet. Will do much me. Damage. I owe you. Oh, oh, power power. Of heroes. Is that this is not <laughs> Sword master! This will do much less damage. Okay. Got it. My thanks. Let's go. Let us hurry. You're so lucky. Right. Hurry. Let's do it. Don't do so. Something. Let's take it with us. <laughs> Great find. <laughs> Keep it. It ought to be safe now. Look! Ready? Finish it, quick! No holding back! Hack and slash! Come forth, royal soul! With blade in hand! I shall vanquish evil! Impossible! That was nullified? Huh? Win! Still here? It burns! Good job, everyone! Talk about a close call! Magic Knight! Oh, 
looks like slash attacks won't do much against the Are you kidding me? Are you prepared? Not now. I defer to you. No. By this power. Now stay sharp. It's not I over yet. Expect no less. It burns. It burns. Hogan burns. Magic burn. knight. She gets hit. Sword master. Captain, I won't hold back. back. You'll take more damage this way, so be careful. Even so... It's all well. <laughs> Onward! What do you think? So we bring the fight to them. something. Let's take it with us. There they go! That should come in handy. Pocket it! Look! That should be it. We don't know what's lurking inside. Stay vigilant, everyone. Tracks. Something small crawled here. Probably the larva of the giant sandworms, right? 
This place is bound to be chock full of them. Maybe what happened is that people mistook the human for some subspecies of the sandworms. Not that they're anything alike. Ugh. Even the memory of being eaten puts a twinge in my nose. I'd rather it stay numb. Stop fussing over a smell. You'll attract the enemy. I just heard something. It can't be. Gallica, which way is the sound coming from? Shh! Be quiet! No, they're footsteps. Someone's coming this way. God up. Who's he? It's coming back. <laughs> How do you know where it's hiding? I think it's gone somewhere. Are you the man we seek? Name yourselves. You mean this is Heisme? I didn't expect to, you chief. He's a you chief. Never seen one in the flesh. We're but another lesser tribe the city dwellers don't care for. We owe you a debt, it seems. A knight of the crown, are you? Is that why you knew my name? Or perhaps you know it from the wanted posters? Both, actually. I flee to the furthest depths, and still they pursue me. Where are the people you kidnapped? What are you talking about? Uh, I suppose there's no point standing around chatting with someone after my head. That weapon. So it truly was part of the Shadow Guard. Shadow Guard? Eyes front. He's a knight to be reckoned with. Here I come! I'll not be anyone's captive without a fight. I'll have to provide some less delicate discouragement. No hard feelings. Allow me to use this. Huh? There's more high space? To push me this far. I did not give you enough credit. But against my mirage arts, your strength means nothing. What the? We've got uh, multiple high space. Uh, looks like we can't brute force through this one. Are you prepared? I can try. Who slow? We tell when we do wide-ranging attacks. Focus on one at a time. What nice shame. dodge! You've got some fancy footwork. I have my method. Little tactic. luck on your side. Or perhaps... No matter. I can't back down either way. Here I come! By the magic knight! I'll look at you! Hold yourself together! Tis best you! Captain, they've slowed you no down! No holding back! Oh, holy no, this is doing nothing! Out. What's going on? Where'd he go? Uh, is that all? Yeah. Uh, A mere flesh wound. Yeah. Is that all? Come forth, royal sword! Yeah. By the magic knight! As the heart uh. of a sword! Now, what I shall vanquish evil! I'll cut you down! Uh. Tougher yeah. than I thought! Most impressive! You've some grand cause to fight for, I'm sure. But I have my own. I've no intention of being so easily snared. Where'd he go? He disappeared just like that. He even wholly surrounded, too. It is bad enough that he's skilled, but we have an environmental disadvantage here. But the very first thing he did was save us from a human, right? So it seemed. Had he not stepped in, he'd be rid of us. 
and not have to bother exposing himself. A passing strange choice for a supposed amoral scoundrel. Well, we don't know anything for sure yet. Worth noting that the petrification magic didn't kick in either, I suppose. Our names still mean nothing then. The people's support is not yet strong enough to protect us. It is frustrating, but we must press on. Should we investigate the hut in the meantime? Maybe we'll find some clues about the kidnappings. Good plan. Let's take a look first. Hmm. Let's do it. Doesn't it seem like... So apparently... What? No. And this place... Right. Hmm. Right then, let's get this plan underway. Eyes way! Come out! Show yourself! Wow, that's some crazy echo. Kind of nice getting to let loose. As long as I'm yelling anyway. Louise! You think you're so bloody untouchable, you bastard! The ravenous, all-devouring she-beast of the Knight's Order! Is this what we've come to? Saying whatever's on our minds? Well, so be it. Kanika! The sound of your wings keeps me up at night! Stroll, you think you're so smart! Absolutely not old-fashioned or stubborn! You didn't even finish. Ah! Enough! Stop this infernal din!
What do you think would happen if that monster showed up without my ears working? You'd all be dead. Is this blasted bounty that important to you? Here's our guest of honor at last. It was never about the money. Children are missing. We can't just ignore a kidnapper. Kidnapper? I see now. As you were saying before, they've named me a kidnapper. A monster preying on children. If the charges are false, I would hear it. In truth, even I've come to doubt the allegations. And why is that, Lady Knight? You've... lost a child yourself, haven't you? I cannot imagine a parent who has endured such pain would kidnap children, much less sell them off. <laughs> Hold on. I can't trust a man who does nothing but flee the people responsible for my home burning. Zorba, who forced the dead to fight on his behalf. Anyone who can't face reality themselves is capable of any low. True enough. If we lived in a world where words alone proved us just, I'd not be living in this infernal cave. I'm sorry, but I won't go to the gallows before I've even honored my son's death. If you'll not leave me be, then we decide this another way. So you're finally ready to fight us properly. Draw steel. If I'm to take your life, I'll not do it from the shadows. But if you refuse to retreat, then ready your blades. We have our reasons for not backing down. Hope you don't think hiding's enough to make us give up and leave. <laughs> Here I come! I was saving this! He's I call away. upon royal power within! <clears throat> so, you saw through my illusion. Even so... The fr- Wind! <sighs> With blade in hand! A blunder! I'll use this. This is nothing. No holding back. I wonder if there's some way to pull them apart. You think yourself equal to a UG agility? Scout! A tough one. Justice for power! Then my fight ends here. What are those strange powers you possess? How'd you cast spells without igniters? What was that? We'll have our answers first. Did you really kidnap all those people from the castle town? Look around you, lad. Where would I keep the victims? Besides, I'm but one man. Kidnapping on the scale you suggest would be damn near impossible. You're saying you were framed? This case even reached the capital, you know. Why would anyone pin such horrors on an innocent man? <laughs> innocent is more generous than most of the world sees me. A Ujif drifter, a disgraced knight condemned by the Sanctists. What couldn't they pin on me? Mm. They cast me out, stripped my titles, and put a price on my head. They would even refuse me the right to mourn my child. And thus... You held back against us, didn't you? You never intended to take our lives. Or perhaps you could not bring yourself to kill a young man. <laughs> Just didn't want to make a mess I'd have to clean up. What do you think? Is Heisme really our kidnapper? I don't think he's the culprit. I agree. That being said, it's also hard to imagine the town maintaining groundless bounty so faithfully. It was the holy lady who named the price, and the guard captain who thereby took it to the capital. To end this as a case of mistaken identity would disgrace their word. You think they must have had a reason to suspect him then? So, what's really going on here? Sounds to me like between the Guard Corps and Heisme, one of them could be lying. Remember when we first arrived? 
We almost got killed by a beast they told us would be asleep. You cannot be suggesting the Guard Corps set us up. Absurd. No, it, it defies all reason. They went to such lengths to place the request. So you think I'm the one lying, do you? Like I said, we don't make assumptions. If there's anything else you know, we're listening. <laughs> You're a strange lot. Fine. Investigate this as you see fit. And if you think I'm guilty by the end of it, put me in chains. What's the matter? Never tied up a captive before? Give it a rest, old man. You'll make a better guide than a captive. Otherwise, the human makes a meal of us and nobody wins. A strange lot indeed. And... Oh, my God, a foul-smelling one to boot. Ugh, don't remind me. Sorry, but you'll have to bear with us. Don't mind me. If the charges prove false, you should be cleared. Still, we'll have to find a new head to be judged for the competition. Then we'll just find whoever's actually behind it and have their head instead. Let's contact Barden tomorrow, but we'll keep quiet about Heismay. Can't tell if we can trust the Guardsmen yet. What are we going to do with Heismay tonight? We can't exactly set him up at the inn. Steady on! You're not leaving me to watch our bounty alone? Fine. Then Nurus and I can both watch him tonight. Better us than risking our candidate, I suppose. Never would have guessed that the bounty hunting was part of this plan to take the throne. And further, you've a lady of the knighthood with you. Not to mention command of a gauntlet runner. I sense there's more to this story, hmm? It's a long story. It is even stranger that the youngest of you is the actual candidate. <laughs> Still, I suppose I can see why they'd put their trust in you. But now the throne's in anyone's reach, eh? Suppose the king's magic wasn't just a myth. Well, hardly matters to an old codger like me. No telling if I'll even live to see the next king crowned. This is all jolly cheerful. And I'm to be stuck between these two old goats the whole night. Don't blame me, lad. You volunteered. Those are some sharp ears. We should probably watch our words in here. 